it will be important day for Bitcoin because today we will have interest rate decision. That's why it could be big volatility. In today's video, I'll share with you why exactly we need to take a trade to make money and save it. And also a few words about what I shared with you before uh, in a previous analysis. Remember, it was exactly this analysis that I shared two days ago. Uh, where I shared with you two plans uh, at uh, taking liquidity at 61 area or at 57 area, we can consider uh, here at 57 long at 61 short. And you can see that Bitcoin bounced uh, exactly before that key area. Honestly, uh, let me be honest with you, I didn't take a trade here because I missed good opportunity because exactly I shared in our community, here you can see Bitcoin trading plans, uh, it was exactly one day after I shared analysis uh, that the best area for long was uh, 57,100. And you can see the Bitcoin bounce it without big volume or absorption. Sometimes something like this happens. But BTC exactly reached this key zone. And at this moment, as you can see, bouncing from key zone. That's the reason why I push like on this uh, idea. And right now, go and follow me on Telegram because you will get op, uh, notification about every update that I share here plus free video analysis at market updates because sometimes I record and write updates only uh, in text or other platforms and you won't miss it. What you do in every video here would be Telegram follow right now. Uh, what about right now what we can do? Uh, before I share with you clear plans uh, where we need to take a trade, let me show to you what could happen with BTC after interest rate decision. Uh, you can see uh, interest rate decision will happen today at 21 o'clock, uh, my GMT plus free time, East European time. Uh, here for you, uh, I took Forbes uh, advisor and uh, all info about this uh, interest rate changes. And let me show to you on a chart uh, what price did during those uh, interest rate uh, changes. Here, I added nearly all of them. Let me show to you here. Nearly all of these interest rate changes. And let me show to you what BTC reacted on that. Uh, the last interest rate uh, change was uh, Wednesday, 26th of July, 2023. And what BTC did? Yeah, exactly nothing. Uh, BTC stay in a range. A range continue for how long? Oh my God, for all entire 21 days, uh, additional three weeks. Uh, locally, uh, if you open the smaller time frame on interest rate, what had happened? BTC just did a helicopter. Uh, to took stop losses. You can see exactly 21 o'clock. It was a moment of interest rate decision. They took higher high and after that they took lower low. That means it was simply, you can see volume increase quite a lot. It was simply stop loss hunt in both directions. And uh, after that, nothing. Okay, let's go and analyze another interest rate decision. Again here, what has had happened? Nothing. They took after that high of this range and after that, as you can see, continue this range for really big period of time. But pay attention that before that interest rate decision, what had happened, significant rise. Often price uh, before the news can already play down that news. And uh, because of that, uh, there could be no reaction or even opposite reaction. Why I know it? Because I spent so many time analyzing the markets and what uh, actually make a move. As you can see here, again, interest rate decision. And what was the, uh, the result? some small volatility price range took high of a range within several days. Nothing interesting. Honestly, there was only one situation when uh, BTC, even two situations, when BTC after interest rate decision started some move. It was exactly this one, Wednesday, 27 July 2022, BTC did this significant rise. But again, what was here uh, far more important, Bitcoin broke uh, this important value and retested POC of this value. What was far important, tell me please, uh, that Bitcoin broke value and just retested or what? Uh, why once more I share with you all of the stuff because you need to know that in most cases, all of the stuff is priced in. And have a look, uh, we analyze so many situations and only one situation where here when Bitcoin uh, after interest rate decision started massive movement and massive dump. But here for me, far more important question, what was far, what was really important here? Uh, it is interest rate or Bitcoin was already in this downtrend. And after this long 
range and accumulation, as you can see, for 116 days, price broke the significant value. As you can see, this interest rate decision was exactly when price was at this local POC and price exactly broke uh, from this value. Once more, my summary for you, in most cases, you won't be able to predict news. Only when something big and unexpected happens, big movement happens. Example for you, Toncoin, uh, when uh, Duro got arrested. What happened to Toncoin? Toncoin did this massive drop with this massive volume. No one could expect it. And quite a lot of people started worrying that the, the, something could happen to their coins and their positions, and they started selling. And because of that, Toncoin uh, dropped 23% within two days. And after that, uh, actually dropped 33%. Uh, that's why we need to know where we exactly can take a trade. Let me show to you my uh, scenarios and plans before I ask you to push like and remind to you uh, that on daily basis, when I have a clear plans, I share with our community signals with clear stop losses, take profits. Plus, I share with our people trading plans with clear explanation where you can take a trade and to make money. Example for you, Sol, uh, like on previous week, so I uh, trade mostly top coins. Solana reached key zone after that I shared uh, where to take a trade and after that Solana did beautiful rise. Same with BTC, Ethereum. Even here, BTC, before this pump, I shared uh, this key zone where to uh, take long. And even here uh, with BTC, yesterday I shared that uh, this key zone from 61 to 60, uh, it would be the best uh, to take a trade for uh, short. What about uh, how you can uh, join our community? Really simple. In the description, there would be link, uh, first link to uh, this board uh, and uh, open this board in telegram and you can get access for free uh, when you open that board start it press start and you will receive all notification uh, you simply open account on bybit exchange as our partner and you get access for free even if you already have account on bybit you can move existing registration under us and uh, just write into a board because my team will connect you through that board and will reply to your, to all questions uh, coming back uh, to what exactly I would like to trade, honestly, nothing special. Uh, I would like to trade first. Mm, I have this key zone 57,500 because uh, uh, it would be the swing low. Uh, and in a case, if BTC would make a retest of this key zone, and that would be some absorption or significant stop loss hunt, here I will take a trade. Uh, second scenario. Uh, if uh, there would be interest rate decision and price stay in the range and there would be no result with bigger chance, BTC would continue this cycle up and there would be rise towards this key zone. And only at this key zone 64, uh, I would look for some short or potential reversal. And also, uh, there could be additional uh, scenario, uh, but this one it is uh, would be hard to trade. If there would be sharp stop loss hunt at this key level 61 200. I know that you watch this video and you want one clear place to take trade where to set stop losses, but trading it is a job of probabilities. And I share with you my scenarios. And uh, what you need to understand uh, stop loss hunt, how stop loss hunt looks like. Stop loss hunt always must be with acceleration when price creates the impulse. Uh, you should understand that. If price, for example, uh, we will have something like this. Sharp impulse with big delta and after that reversal. It is reversal. Uh, it would be a signal that we should take a reversal signal. But imagine a situation that price creates such local range and starts to squeeze up. It is a breakout pattern. Uh, that's why once more, Key zones that at this moment I analyze. Uh, first key zone, it is above this local high, but there must be once more stop loss hunt with really sharp with a big uh, uh, big delta. Second key zone here and third key zone here. In all other cases, we would wait because uh, if there would be other patterns, we will need time. At this moment, I prepared for you a video about my secret indicator. It is VWAP. Even yesterday, Bitcoin bounced from that key zone at VWAP, as you can see this one. Uh, I highly advise you to learn what it is, how to use it in the future and make money. Have a good time.